Hi, I'm Brian Essick from How To Automotive, and today I wanted to talk to you about being the new guy in shop or the starting your automotive career out and what type of tools you're going to start buying. And today I wanted to feature the VIM oil filter adapters that you're, you're going to be using on a day-to-day -day basis. Most likely you're going to start out on the loop rack and you're going to be doing lots of oil changes to start out with. And there's lots of new tools coming out for all these new vehicles and I wanted to show you these, feature these and uh, show you the difference between some of the cheaper brands versus these quality brands and why you would want to pick these up. So stay tuned for that. So nowadays, a lot of vehicles are going to the canister style oil filters and they require special sockets and tools to uh, get the oil filter filters off, especially on European and Asian vehicles. Here I am using one of the VIM sockets to remove a BMW oil filter. Now these canister style oil filters have been around for quite a while now, but there's more and more manufacturers coming out with them and coming out with different styles and shapes and stuff of them. So I teamed up with VIM Tools because they make one of the best master kits and the, one of the most quality tool sets you'll find on the market for removing all these different assortments of uh, oil filters. So the reason why I'm bringing these to you is this is where you're gonna start out is on the loop rack, you're gonna be doing a lot of oil changes and having the right tools for the right job is going to help you be more efficient, which is going to be a benefit for you guys. For your boss is going to see that, that you're, you're investing in quality tools and that you're efficient and it's going to help you progress faster. So in this first couple of clips here, I've been featuring the European Master Set. This set has all the popular models you're going to be working, run across and working with. So you're going to, you're going to, it's going to do your Volkswagen, your Audi, your Volvo, your Mercedes, your BMW, your Mini Cooper, Land Rover. It's going to be the most common vehicles that you're going to run across on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, so that's why I recommend this particular set. I will link this up in the description of the video. So this next set is designed to work with all your Asian vehicles that have the uh, canister filters. So in each one of the cases is a diagram of uh, what oil filter adapters will, will fit which vehicles. So you can look up the part numbers on the oil filter adapter here and uh, figure out which car you're working on. So right here I'm using a Toyota. I looked up the adapter and I, I found the, the proper adapter in the case. So you can take the guesswork out. If you're really anything like me, you'll just probably just grab one and throw it on there and see if it fits. But So these are extremely thick and durable which is great because some of these Toyota vehicles, the oil filter housing will literally adhere itself or stick on the housing and it can take a ton of leverage to get them off. Right here, these are designed to work with the half inch drive ratchets or you can put a socket over the end of the oil filter adapter. So the quality of the VIMs are, are second to none. If you look at these other brand here and look how thin and cheap they are, um, and also some of the other brands, they don't come in kits. You have to up, buy them a la carte. So it's way more expensive to buy them one at a time as you run across them. So these thin stamp metal type like this one right here I'm showing you are very prone to flexing and also the end of it will actually strip out. If you look right here, it's almost rounded out and it's pretty much useless after a while. So you can see here, if you invest in cheap tools, you're gonna constantly rebuy them, which will not benefit you in any way. Another feature I like about them is when you have to clean them, they have a hole on the bottom. So having the hole on the bottom makes it much easier to clean. Some of the other brands do not have a hole in them and it just collects the oil in the bottom and it makes it very difficult to clean. So this VIM one here, all it does take, requires to clean it out is maybe use some parts cleaner or brake clean and you can spray it in here and as you spray it, it will drain out the bottom of it. That's just one more way this will make it more efficient for you to, to own. So when, as you spray those and clean them out, it's much easier than uh, wiping and trying to pour out the uh, oil. Links for both the Asian and the European kits will be in the description. I'm Brian Essek from How To Automotive. I'd like to thank you guys for watching my videos. I encourage you to subscribe. I invite you to head over to the howtoautomotive.com website for more valuable videos like this. Thank you again for watching and be sure to subscribe.